Hey, good afternoon, everybody. Uh, I, I lost track of time. Apologies, starting a couple minutes later than I meant to. Um, why am I from? Oh, right, because I got the spooky witch hat. Halloween time, baby. So this framing works for that. Does it? Um, yeah, just more Metroid Dread. I've been having a great time with it. Uh, we got our boss fight going on. So here we go. I think I can do it. This one is not nearly as hard as that one, uh, sort of scorpion boss from before. It's not easy, you know, but it's certainly seen more difficult. Let's watch the cutscene again. It's pretty good. Looking. Whoa! See, he big. But it doesn't feel nearly as big as in Super Metroid, where he's like just massive. So, I don't know. It's like, it's cute to see him back, but it's, as far as boss fights go, given the legacy of this particular character, it's a bit disappointing. For dinner. For dinner. Not waste. A little loosey goosey with it. I mean, that's how I always am with this freaking game, you know? I'm always like, I just gotta be careful, and then I just don't, I don't be careful, because it's just, I don't know, that's always my personality. It's the same reason, even though I love strategy games, I'm really bad at them. My move is always just like, attack, attack, attack. It's like sometimes not as the right move. Munch, munch, munch. Eat your dessert. Rage, you're gonna eat your dessert and you're gonna like it! You have to wonder how the uh, perspective works here. It's like he's throwing those fingernails forward, as far as I can tell, but they're somehow still on the same plane as me. I don't know. Confusing. Oh. Hammering down on that. He's gonna, like, break free in like, a second. He's here, for sure. There's no way that this is just a little boss fight. Going off the yeah, there we go. Come on, come on, bus free. I know you can do it, buddy. I know you can manage. Oh, yeah, there it is. There it is. Whoa, dude, ew, it's gross belly. Not a fan of that. That. Oh gosh, I don't want that. No, thank you. Okay, I just gotta be able. Oh, he bounced back. Oh boy, this is actually pretty hard second phase so far. Oh, there's those. Oh, oh, there was a spider link thing. Ah, crap. Well. That's okay. First attempt of the day, I'm just getting warmed up. All right, we got we got further than in the the last attempt I did at least. All right, and we 
we don't need to watch the cutscene every time. Missing. something I'm loving about the combat in this game is that you have like total control to like goad your opponents. You know, no matter how formidable they are, you kind of control how they move and such because you can anticipate how they're going to act. It's really clever and it makes for some really, really fun combat. Post on r slash voiceover Steve Bloom showing his temporary VO setup. It's always fun. One of my favorite parts of VO is when you're traveling or whatever and you have to figure out how to record from, you know, not from the booth. Uh, some people's idea is like, oh, make a temporary booth, you know, or you can buy things that are like, well, this is, you know, it's not soundproofed, but it's treated at least, so it won't sound all echoey. So that's that's good enough. And if you use the right microphone, like what I'm using here, my, um, this is not my booth, obviously. This is my bedroom slash studio. It's very efficient in this case. Uh, but the microphone I'm using is a super cardioid. So even though my, my bedroom is not super treated, you can probably see there's like blankets on the wall and such to do a little bit. Um, but the super, super cardioid means that it's not like pulling in a ton of the echoes and stuff off the walls. So even though it's not super well treated, for uh, reverb, it's not too bad. You know, good enough for streams. I don't think I would do the most client recordings. If it's like something chill, I might do it in here. But uh, you know, if it's like I got to be shouting, it's like well. Not gonna do that much. But for a stream, streams are pretty, pretty casual in comparison. You know, people still prefer that it be as professional sounding as possible. But sometimes you don't get the choice. Oh God, the creep's so gross. Whoa! whoa. Ugh. Go. There's like a rhythm to it. Ugh. It's so gross. Ugh. Ah, dang it. Literally saying watch his hands and I totally missed. Missed him swinging. Yeah, this is really good. Super fun. Makes me think of Punch Out, honestly. Where you gotta like watch for the tells, you gotta dip and dodge, but it's all like super strategic platforming. Really fun stuff. Really loving this game. out of the Like they are 
space pirates who do space pirate stuff, but they, uh, they also seem, like, animalistic. It's hard to tell how much actual, like, human agency they have. Ah, dang it. I also love, you know, getting your health drops from projectiles because it's this, it creates this balance of, like, do I, do I risk it and, like, possibly lose more health than I could gain? And then, as you get better at it, it stops mattering as much. Ooh. Ah, oh my gosh, that did so much damage. No. Just in time for Halloween, we have Metroid Dread for the Nintendo Switch Tainment System. Find your way through six creepy levels. <laughs> I was just doing um, a script class earlier this morning, and the thing they had was like, the zombie whopper from Burger King. Um, which was like, it was super fun, because it's just like being super silly and spooky, Halloween time, you know? Uh, but the the concept of a zombie whopper because they're like they've come back from the dead after you've eaten them and it's like I don't want to think about my food coming back to be re-eaten that's a pleasant image whoops no, no, watch out watch out My second E tank, but it's only like. cartoony and less realistic, the fingernail thing seemed just kind of generally scary, but uh, it's really gross. Ooh, ouch. Shut that. See, this feels like what Super Metroid was supposed to feel like, you know? Like, you can tell a lot of these ideas they wish they could have done back then. The way Samus controls is like so much more fluid, and, like easier to handle. Gonna, gonna swing. Whoa. Oh, oh, I I missed that. Okay. Whoa. Crap, crap, crap. Got missiles. Very low on health. Drops give you like five missiles. It's like, I don't know if I can get any less than that. I don't like how squishy these are. Flesh! Okay. Right there. Ah, dang it. Close. Close. 
That second phase, yeah. I was hoping that it would get a little trickier and, uh... Be careful what you wish for, I guess. Because it got pretty tricky. Fireball hits you and it undoes like all the health you got during this phase. You really gotta watch out for him. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Whoa. Gosh. Oh, this is so hard. It's like. So so satisfying. Oh! Got him right at the last second there. Hold on. I'm gonna put a stream marker. That was pretty cool. Alright. Back at it. Whoops. Oh. Ew. 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 I don't like it. Ah, it was much too early. That's the yep, that's the splash. That's the splash. Oh god, they're so gross. Oh, yes, 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 get him! That was super cool though. I'm really loving the melee counters for the bosses. God, I'm just loving this game in general. It's so good. Like the earlier Metroids, I'm just like, oh, they're really hard and they don't feel like great. But, like these ones, all the latter ones, like, so good. I got plenty of health. Ah, 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 dang it. The meat ball. Uh-oh. These are way easier to deal with with the charge. Just never have found a good instinct for using the charge I guess. Ooh. Ah, watch out. Oh, those do so much damage. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, come on. Yeah. Get him, get him. Oh, cutscene. Any quick time event? I appreciate they don't do quick time events during the cutscenes, but just. Gross. <laughs> but just during the fights themselves. Oh. Is that is that it or is he gonna come up for one more? I don't trust that. Feels like he's gonna come back. I don't know. Oh hey! What do we got? What do we got? Diffusion! Yes! The diffusion beam. All 
All right, how's the diffusion work? Yeah, it basically just gives you an area of effect. Oh, that's how you're supposed to get those. I see. Uh -oh. oh, you can jump as ball, I didn't even notice. Yes, jump as ball. portal take me back to Dairon. Okay. Uh, not yet. I will do that for certain. I mean, I'm pretty sure I gotta continue with the story, but uh, I'm just gonna... Oops. I did not find it all. That might be a high jump thing. Well, that's alright. Let's just head over to Dairon. I'm sure we'll get a chance to come back here. Except. Alright. Long old cutscene. Let's do it. Ah. Gotta remember to sit up straight. I frame myself up sitting up straight every time. Ah, finally hit the gym today. It's just, the thing is, like, during the weekday, I have to get up at 6 if I want to hit the gym, and then I gotta walk two miles through the Georgia heat. Ugh, terrible. So I don't, most of the times I just put it off, which is not good if you want consistent gains, but, you know. Wow, this entire path is just using stuff that I just gained. Various suit, wide beam, morph ball. Any tank is worth it. Yeah. Oh no, it's just an energy part. That's not really worth it, but whatever. Gonna be able to swim in that lava, I can already tell. Gonna guess gravity suit? There we go. Sometimes she doesn't jump quite as high. I don't know why. Hey, Adam. It's been a minute. Uploading data. This area Adam. appears to be a biological research laboratory. You have already reactivated one generator in this area. There is another sector above you still suffering from the blackout. Find the next generator and reactivate it. All right. You are slowly recovering your abilities. I have still not established what happened to you physically. Don't let your guard yeah, down. Gonna, your uh... primary objective is to survive. Proceed with the utmost care. Yep. Save your progress. Absolutely. Absolutely, I'll save my progress. Uh, now, yeah. You can use the, the assignable paddles. I remember when I was in, like, high school, some of my, like, classmates would, uh, call game controllers paddles. Have you guys ever heard that? I don't know why that was, like, a thing. It's weird. Oh, okay. There we go. We're in the Emmy zone. In the Emmy zone, baby. Can I? Can I cloak as ball? Nice. Uh oh. Uh oh. Crap. Nope, nope. Ah. Uh, ah, dang it. Here we go. Uh -huh. ah. Early. Early on that one. 
I mean, at least like everything I see about the the melee counter for that is like it's literally last ditch. Probably will not work. Don't like worry about missing it. The real strategy. The real strategy is just to uh. It's just to uh not get hit in the first place. Nope, nope, I phantom cloak. Uh, deep phantom cloak too fast! Ah, uh, dang it. Uh, ah, too late, too late. I'm sure there's like fighting gamers or whatever who see that and they're like, yeah, we got it. We got it. We are, we are the best. What? Ah. Uh. Whoa! I got him. I got him. It's like fighting gamers are the premiere at like seeing things frame by frame and stuff. My eyes are not fast enough for that. Uh oh. Uh oh. You can see me. Ah, uh, oh, oh, dang it, I tried to ball. Ooh, uh, nope. I tried to ball under there, but uh, I guess I was a little too... a little too loose on it. Realized, didn't realize. Gotta keep moving. Ah, ah, ah. Uh oh. Made noise. Jeez. I'm gonna just spawn. Do not worry about me. No. Uh. Faster. Samus, faster. Ha, ha. Oh, God. No. Ah. Oh. oh, snap. Oh, I can't. Oh, wait. I can run out here. Oh. Whoa. This huge bug. That's scary. Oh my gosh. I'm getting better. I'm getting better at in the Emmys where where they oh, where they live. Where they go. Oh, I can't do that cuz I can't. Right. I mean, I don't want to go back into the Emmy zone. <laughs> oh, he moved. You see that? Right, did he? Where I saw this arm over here move. <gasps> yeah, yeah, he twitched. That's scary. Ooh, that's real scary. This game this is a pretty scary game. Yeah, you really got to get good at the movements in this game. I can't do whatever that is. Crap. Oh, Emmy heard me. Whoops. Gotta keep moving. Nope, I, sp I spider magneted. <laughs> no, no, no! Ah, oh, it was too early. Too early. Brick. Okay. Let me back here. Whoops. Something out for those guys. They are a pain in the humps. She's 
quite fast. She's quite fast. Oh no, I can't go. Is there any like secrets here? No, I guess not. Well, I guess I'll hang out for a minute. up against it and then you hit B to a ball. Hey, Star the Foxy, thanks for showing up. Uh, thanks for tuning in. Whatever we call it here on Twitch. It's, it's a confusing platform. Uh, it's great so far. I'm, I'm really loving this. I was saying earlier, it's like this feels like what Super Metroid was thinking. You know, where Super Metroid, it's like, it was really fun. Um, but there were parts where it's like, mm, the controls are a little stiffer than I'd like. You know, everything's a little underwhelming, but it's like this. This feels like what they were really trying to do with that game. And it's, mm. That's what I've been loving about Switch in general, is like every mainline game so far feels like they finally got to do the version of the game that they wanted to. Like Mario Odyssey feels like what Super Mario 64 wanted to be. Um. Breath of the Wild feels like what Zelda's always wanted to be. And like this, this feels so good. Um, that and like Fusion was amazing. Uh, like I, I liked Fusion a lot. It got, it got really annoying in those last couple bosses, like around the Nightmare and on, it got really frustrating. Um, but then I finally started using a D-pad and it's like, oh, okay, this game's actually great. It's just the analog stick doesn't work very well. Um, and then Zero Mission. I haven't finished Zero Mission yet, uh, because I started it on Sunday, but I'm definitely gonna finish that one. That one's incredible, too. It is, I was not expecting it to be as in-depth as it was. I expected it's like, oh, it's just better graphics, original Metroid, but it's like, no, it's, they, they went ham. Uh, the Emmys are a little annoying, but I don't mind. I'm, a, I'm... I'm a fan of, like, stealth games when they're done right, and I feel like the stealth parts of Emmy are are, are pretty well done. It, it's really aggravating, but it's, like, it's aggravating in a way that feels fair. If I get caught, it's like, well, I'm messed up. And you always have the option to break away if you hit that, that quick time event. Oh, my God, the yellow Emmy is so fast. So fast. Yeah, I don't mind the Emmys as much. Um, last night, I did get kind of stuck because there's the the part where you do Dairon and then you have to like backtrack and that wasn't very obvious. So I did, I did look up a walkthrough for that. But other than that part, I have not looked up a walkthrough. No, nothing yet. The yellow Emmy, honestly, I think the green Emmy was scarier to me because he was the first one to start going through all the little gaps. The yellow one, as long as you have enough distance between you. I don't, I, I have no idea how the fight's gonna go once I find the, the um, central unit for that yellow Emmy. Like, I'm not gonna have enough time to, to blast off that face shield. Yeah, well, it wasn't, as with all the Emmys, it's like, once you can predict their movements, you do pretty good. But uh, the thing I've been really impressed by is just how smart the Emmy AI is. Like, there's so many times where I'm like, oh, I'm just gonna, like, circle around and I'm gonna trick it, like you do in, like, most stealth games. But it's like, no, like, if you try and circle around, it predicts that and goes at you and cuts you off where you thought you were gonna go. It's really, really smart AI, and it makes those parts so fun. Yeah, I, I came into this just being like, yeah, I know Super Metroid's like the best game on uh, SNES, but it's like, nah, playing, playing through all the Metroids, this is easily one of my favorite series now. It's so good. Like the combat in this one, oh, with the melee counters, and like the bosses, the, the scorpion boss where you have to like mad dog on it and like get 
You have to like get in really close on it to convince it to like back up. Oh my god, that was so good. Ah, dang it. I'm not not super great at the melee counters still. There we go. Yeah, the hidden walls are much less obvious. I mean, there's little, like, brain things. Yes! Bomb! Finally! They really... It's quite a while before you get the, the morph suit in this. Or the, the morph ball. Which was really surprising for Metroid. Usually you have it, like, right at the front. Um... Yep, it's a morph ball. Wait, did it say... Whoa! Wait a minute, did it say... Something about launchers? Samus can also activate morph ball launchers with a bomb blast. What does that mean? What do you mean by bomb blast? Like... You know what, it's probably like something I'm gonna find in a minute, I'm guessing. I'm not gonna stress about it, that's probably just like an object, right? And you can jump his ball! That was the best part of fusion, being able to jump his ball finally. Oh! I haven't gotten to that part with the underwater movement um, yet. I, I, I just beat Kraid and came back to Dairon to get uh, to turn on the energy in the second area. Oh, I see. That's what they meant. It's fine. Um, you know, I, I expect it's like, oh, Ridley's probably going to come back, Kraid's probably going to come back, all that stuff. You know. I don't mind, like, if you want to spoil abilities, um, I don't mind that much. So... You know, don't, no worries. Just just watch yourself, McCoy. McCloud. Star Fox. Hey. The jokes. The map room. One thing I find a little annoying is just how long, like, the animations are for, like, the map room. And the, the save animations are a little much. They're a little long. It's not the worst. But it's, it's, you guys could have made those a little shorter. Oh, yeah. I mean, yeah, I did, like, a four-and-a-half-hour stream yesterday and got up to Kraid. Um, oh, that's ice. I can tell that's ice. Can't do that yet. No. Stop it. I need to get, um, I need to play Metroid Prime now to get some more of the story. And I gotta get Samus Returns on the 3DS. I haven't played that one. I, I played the original Metroid 2 back on, ooh, back on, uh, you know, original Game Boy, but I have not played the remake. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. That. Wow. <laughs> oh, no. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, my man. Poor, poor boy. He's just big. Why must you harm him because he's big? Yeah, I'm curious too. Because, like, um, when they finally introduced the, the ice... There wasn't... Like, fusion is where they introduced the vulnerability to ice set thing. But then there were only, like, not that many areas that actually had the ice. Like, I guess there were the blue X parasites, but they were barely, like, even an afterthought, you know, once you could deal with them. Ah, Emmy door, here we go. Uh oh. Oh, she's right there. Oh, crap! Probably should run. Probably should run. I think I have time. Ah, 
Huh? No, 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 no. Nope. I'm out. I'm out. Nope. Oh, crap. Uh oh. Okay. Can we get this? Mm -hmm. Ah, too early. I've gotten it a few times, but I'm I'm still not still not able to nail that most of the time. Oh yeah, yeah, they just combined the various suit to be like it's just extreme temperatures. It wasn't just hot. It's like mm -hmm. I presume that I presume there's going to be a new kind of suit. Go 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 go. Ah, frick, these explodey guys are the worst. I should have just gone under. Ah, no, don't grab. <laughs> Metroid, don't grab. Ah, ah, no. ah, ah, ah. Oh. oh my god. Oh. Ah, crap. Ah. be packed in with gravity suit. Hard to say. Down, dude. All right. Oh, another shuttle. Where are we headed this time, boys? Oh, that's a pretty small area. Burinia. Yeah, let's do Burinia. I might be getting ahead of myself, but... We'll find out. Also, the load times between regions is a little annoying. There's a lot of wait time in this, which is, you know, not great, but it's pretty few and far between. The actual gameplay, you know, it, it runs so smooth and fast that... It's, it's not the worst. I'm curious if it'll be faster um, on the OLED, which I'm kind of considering getting. Uh, yeah, I don't know. At first I was like, the OLED doesn't look like anything special. It's mostly for handheld, but it's like, well, it does run better. And considering I have like, one of the OG switches from launch. And it start, it's starting to kind of chug on some of these games. It's starting to really like blast those fans. Um, and I, the fan got like a little caught earlier. It was like clicking and I had to kind of jiggle it. Just get jostled it a little bit to get it going. So, you know, maybe I, maybe I should get the OLED, I don't know. I'm doing pretty well financially right now. Uh, between this and I like bought both of the Smash Fighter packs, I think I'm good on uh, on games for right now. Maybe in the future. I t the thing is, I'd rather save up for like a a, a proper streaming PC. Because right now this is, you know, this this one works fine. There there's a lot of stuff I can't do with it, and it it's, it's, as you can probably tell, it gets kind of choppy. Yeah. I see what you mean. It's like, I, I think it's partially because her movement overall is a lot faster and more fluid, so this just feels like it's much better movement than in the uh, in past games would be in the water. But, um, yeah, it, it, they're letting you do quite a bit. Quite a bit more than you would have before. Beesh. Uh oh. Ooh. Eat these guys. Oh, thank you. I see if there's a melee counter, but I can't reach him. Oh wow, is my health that low? Oh, 
that's a good question. Um, I mean, I would say the missiles are technically just better because you can quick fire them, right? Like, they're slow, but then, like, the charge beam takes a minute. Um, it feels like they're about equivalent, equivalently strong. Um, Uploading data. Yeah, no. Adam! This is not how I expected him to sound in fusion. Abilities such as the grapple beam or space jump will help you to jump to an extent. Find them as soon as possible. Space jump. Space jump. Save. Uh oh. Oh boy. Looks like there's some issues with my uh grocery pickup order. Yeah, one sec. I gotta I gotta deal with that. Yeah, no, no. Sorry, sorry, sorry. And view details, that's what I want. Honey butter biscuits. Okay, okay. Sorry, this is a little... A little bit... Okay, sorry about that. Uh, oh yeah, I guess charge is a little easier to aim. I don't know, I guess despite having played a bunch of the Metroids, I never really got in the habit. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay, wasn't expecting that. I never really got in the habit of doing the charge beam. I don't know, it's just, it's... <laughs> yeah, it's something about it just doesn't doesn't work with my brain. Oh my god. Alright, I've really got to run in and do that. It's hard to say. Um, I'd say you can get off more missile blasts in a single, like, phase with bosses, so... Probably... Oops. Nope. Hold on, hold on. Just gotta, just gotta run in. Whoops. Ah, dang it. I got a little too close. All right, one one more shot at that, and then I'm gonna have to, if that doesn't work, I'm gonna re-strategize. Whoops. Totally forgot. Looked at, oh, oh, dang it. For some reason I expected to. Power bomb. Haven't got the power bomb. Literally just got the regular bomb. Right? Yeah, I just got regular bomb. Oh my god. Every time I forget. Let's see if two rooms is enough. There we go. Fine, I dealt with them. Bane and the Thokish, but I felt. Gosh, these guys are so hardy. Ah, that's only an angle one. Oh, well, can't do that one yet. Slide, there we go. Sliding has also taken some getting used to. So used to, like, Oh, it's one block height. Ball. Oh, why did that open? I presume that's like a high thing. There we go. I'm, I'm getting 
in it. Can I make it? Nope. Can I make it from here? Nope. Oh, there's a spider making it the only one I noticed that. This guy. These guys are so annoying. And they don't have a melee counter as far as I can tell. That doesn't look good. Hold on, is there a secret something? Hey, looks like a sit up. Oh, looks like a secret something. Ah, flipping, flapping. Ah, there we go. friends asking, like, why are Creed and Ridley back in Super Metroid, even? Because they really don't explain that in that game. I guess they explain it more in Prime. Or at least that's what the internet has said is where they explain it, but, like, yeah, that's not... It's really bizarre that it's always the same enemies, and most of the time they're just like, eh, they're just back. Because, like, uh, Super Metroid is, in a lot of ways, sort of like less a sequel and more a reimagining of the first one. Ah, no, I want the tank. Kisses. Jump as ball. Some ex parasite phase on. That was that was the main thing I saw is like uh Ridley phase on energy, I don't know. Ex parasites and phase on are basically this this series' nanobots, the way Metal Gear Solid uses those. Or nano machines, excuse me. Room. Yeah, this this save animation, it's a little much. It's only I, I'd say if they cut it cut it in half by like one turn it from like two seconds to one second, it'd be just fine. But it's like just just long enough that it's a little obnoxious. Mm -hmm. Oh, my light back there. Oh. We got to plug it back in. So it was running on battery. I will uh, I will get that in a minute. Uh-oh. No. No. I really messed that whole situation up. Let me grab. Yeah, there we go. Oh, no. Oh, no. I feel like I shouldn't be falling this far. Nope. Nah, they seem like they're they're not trying to kill me, at least, which is about the same thing. Okay. They're mostly just getting in the way. It's a crime punishable by death in the court of Metroid. Uh, 
I love that detail that sometimes the doors take a little longer to open. Which I'm, I presume will be important later in some kind of run away from Emmy outside of the Emmy zone. That's my prediction, is that they're gonna be able to escape from the Emmy zones at some point. Like they're all gonna be returned by X Parasite or something. Oh, cutscene, this boss. Oh boy. I don't know if I trust that. Mm -hmm. Is this okay? Is this safe? Flash shift? Where's flash shift? Where's flash shift? Oh, it's a back dash. Or well, it's a, it's a dash. So hold A to charge it. Or just press A at any time. And it can be used in midair. Four or three total. But you basically only get one set per. Okay. Whoops. Let me get a second. I mean, that makes sense. It's similar to like how D D um 5th edition, like, took a bunch of ideas from newer RPGs. Which, like, that that just tracks, you know? Why, why wouldn't you do that if people have been uh, improving the style of gameplay that you pioneered? Why wouldn't you use some of their ideas as well? Collaborative effort, in a way. I'm okay with that. Um... Yeah. Oh, okay, I'm seeing. I'm seeing how you use this. Okay, so. Whoops. Figured some of that'd be good. Three One Piece books. Oh gosh. I'm I'm so sorry. I read I read One Piece up through the Sanji arc, and then I was like, I'm gonna take a break for a while, and then all of One Piece happened. Which uh, which ones did you get? Are they the newest ones? Because I know the series is ending soon, right? That's what I've heard. Yes, third E tank, third E tank, and I also have three E parts. I do plan to read through One Piece at some point. It's just so much. So much. I'm still reading through Kaiji, which is a great series, but it's this long. Oh, okay, so you're starting One Piece now. Yeah. Uh, I think it's a really great series. Like, I did really love reading it, but the thing, it's like I had a subscription to Shonen Jump when it used to be physical. Um, and then when they... Yeah, when that subscription ran out, I was just like, well, I'm just not going to do any more. Okay, so you, you're up through 15. There's like... Hold on, let me see. There's like... 50? No. There's like 90 volumes, right? 90 to like 100 or something? It's like a, a huge series at this point. Like, the, the show has, like, a thousand episodes. So there's got to be, like, a hundred volumes or something, right? Ninety-seven. Almost a hundred. I wonder if they're going to crack it or if it's going to end before that. Yeah, that's just... <laughs> One Piece is, like, the war and peace of manga in that it's, mo it's more known for being long than anything else. Well, 
Although, I, it's not the longest. I believe it's not even within like the top 10 longest manga. Because there's some with like 150 volumes plus. But they're mostly like comedy, slice of life, or, like kid stuff. You know, like Pretty Cure, I'm pretty sure, is like a longer running series overall than, um. Now, than, uh. How oh, you can't do the flash dash, whatever, in here. Okay. But, like, Pretty Cure is also, like, several different shows. Ah, gosh. There's so much on my reading list already. Um, I, like, binged through uh, Funetsu... Funetsu no Nate e? Uh, to Your Eternity. Or to you, the immortal, whichever you want to call it, um, <clears throat> which is I, easily one of my favorite series. It, it's it it make me cry. It's very very beautiful. I've been working through Kaiji, which is six. It's six parts, which average out to thirteen volumes per part. It's so slow, but like when it when it uh, when it does its thing, man, it's. Mwah. Beautiful. So good. But it's it's so slow. Jojo. Jojo's another one. It's like a huge undertaking. Jojo is one of those ones where it's like you either love it or don't care at all. I don't think there's anyone who hates it or is like, it's bad. They're just like, it's just really long. I, I've started JoJo a couple times. It's good. I, I like it. It's just, uh, it's a lot. DNA, uh, we're working through the most recent season, and we're gonna, we're gonna see the, um, the movie when it's, like, hits theaters for, like, the special event. Uh, that show's pretty good. I feel like it's kind of stagnated, honestly. Like, I love the characters and everything, but it's just, like, at this point, I'm like, eh. There's not, like, a lot of really shocking reveals or anything super exciting. They're just kind of actually going to school. Keep forgetting that he spits up guys. Ah, no, thank you. No, thank you. Oh my god. Ah. I, nope, I don't have that yet. Um, I would say, you know, you've probably been recommended Demon Slayer if you've talked to anybody in anime. Um, one that, like, really surprised me was really good was uh, Jujutsu Kaisen, which was from a season or two ago. That one only has, like, one season right now. And it's, like, like plot-wise, it's pretty basic shonen kind of stuff. But, like, the characters are so strong, and the fight scenes are amazing. So, like, that that one was, like, a surprisingly great shonen. Hmm. Where do I go? What do I do? This is something entirely new. I'm a huge fan of anime, but I still haven't seen a lot of the uh, classics. You know, you're... I, I watched some of Evangelion. Cowboy Bebop, obviously, is a classic. Which they're making that movie. And I am keeping my enthusiasm guarded. I'm, I'm kind of hype. I think John Cho looks really good as Spike Spiegel. 
Um, I find it very weird that they didn't include Ed, who is like one of the most popular characters. It's very strange that they decided to exclude her character. It'd be like... I don't know. I guess it, it's... It's like if they made a Dragon Ball movie and they didn't add Krillin, I guess. Or, well, okay, maybe a better. Like if they didn't add Trunks in like a DBZ movie, I'd be like, uh, it's a little weird. I feel like I'm just spinning my wheels here. Where am I to go? Just drop down and then Flat. Oh, I can, right, I can't do the flash in the air. I forgot. Hmm. Just see if there's, like, a way to break through here. You know you're in desperation time when, uh, you start doing that. I appreciate, um, this is the first time it feels like you are really underwater, underwater. The other times it's felt like Samus is just kind of slowed down, but now it feels like really chugging along with that same weight. Can I wall jump? Can I wall jump down here? No. Oh yeah, I didn't go up here yet, did I? the teleport. I feel like I, I probably have to go back, right? It's usually the case when you get a new ability like this. Uh, yeah, there's like a whole area over here I haven't looked at. That's all about. I can't get up there yet. Yeah, I'm gonna backtrack. I think that's that's where we're going with this, right? Alright, this is where I got this. Where at? Uh, well, may as well save. Uh, I'm gonna think on this for a bit. I'm gonna go, uh, I'm gonna go take a quick break, hydrate myself, you know, plug in the light back there since I forgot to, but uh, don't go anywhere, don't touch the internet dial, I'll be right back with more Metroid Dread in just a minute.
All right, I am back. Let's let's backtrack here. Whoops, might be getting close. Mm, got him still. Oh, that's skills, baby. Full charge shots. These guys are ridiculous. Did go over there. Okay. Hmm. Maybe that's the way I'm supposed to go. Uh, right. Seems like the correct way. Ah, ah, no thank you. Stop. Stop. Oh, I didn't do anything over here yet. Okay. Oh, another shuttle? Where's this one go? Oh, to a different part of Dayron. Dairon. Dayronian. Hmm. Whatever we call it. Underwater. That's Metroid, baby. Sometimes you just gotta spin your wheels for a bit until you remember where you're supposed to go. Time. We're in Emmy time. Oh, it's yellow Emmy still. Oh no! Oh no! Not in the water. Let the Emmy go in the water. Yep, Emmy goes in the water. Oh, coming right after me. Here we go. Ah, dang it! Barely snagged me. Whoa, got her. Getting better at that. Oh, can't go that way. Oh no! No! <laughs> faster, faster, faster! Uh, ooh, uh, oh, no! Ah! No! Ah, dang it. Another save. Nope, too early. <clears throat> dang it. Ah, I almost got it. I gotta remember to do the little zips. I wanna be careful though, cause you only get like one per charge, right? Uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh. Ah, she hasn't seen me yet, she hasn't seen me yet. Oh actually, yes, saved. Oh, 
Hey, the central unit. All right. Why is this the way they guard all the central units? With the with the energy Cheerios and the little turrets. Seems like a silly method. Oh, there we go. <clears throat> All right. Getting geared up. This is my... This is the fifth Emmy? Fourth or fifth. I'm trying to remember. I think fourth. Oh, right. You got to... Whoa. Nope. Ah, a little late. A little late on that one. It's fine. It's fine. Come at me. Come at me. Oh jeez, oh, so fast. So fast. Uh, oh hey! Well actually I should probably run this way so I have plenty of space. Oh my god, oh it's so fast! Oh yeah, I'm getting pretty good at that. Ah. Nope, too early. If you start hitting them with the, the uh, Omega Blast, Omega Beam, whichever it is, it slows down, but it's like, it's real tricky to do that. Pretty hard. Mm. Oh, 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 oh. Get the face, get the face, get the face. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, dang it. Oh. Ah, a little early. Little early. Come at me. Dad, ah, not quite. Oops, too early. Too early. Gotta get the rhythm for it. And I gotta quit slouching. It's back on my back. Actually, let me see. Can I just. Uh -oh. Ah, dang it. Oh, ah, too late, too late. Oh, oh, maybe, maybe, maybe. Uh, 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 ah. Close. Not very good at the free aim. Pop. Too early. You can see, I like that you can see the foot go. So even if you're too early, you know like, oh, okay, I, I missed. I see. All right, let's get it. Just 
Cool. Almost, almost. Yes. Ah, uh. oh, dang it. Ah, too early. One more try. I think I can do. I think this is it. I think this is the one. Room. Uh, no, no, no. I messed up. Ah, too early. Come on now. Almost, almost. Uh oh, I don't think I'm gonna get it. Nope, not quite. Uh, ah, too early. I I can I think I can manage. Um. Yeah, I think I'm gonna try and take off the face up here, and then run down there to give myself a little room to charge up the uh, sort of make a blaster beam. Whoops. Nope. Nope. Too early. Yeah, I'll try, I'll definitely try to do a little run and gun on this one. I can't get in the face in the first. Salvo. Oh, wait, 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 almost, almost. Bust up your face, okay, and then we're running away. No, I missed, no! Oh, last second. Whew, that was very close. Almost, almost didn't get that, but I, I, that, that second blast. All right, and now we can do the fast runs, right? Speed booster, that's what they call it. Allows Samus to dash at supersonic speed. Okay, so it's L3. Tilt L down to ready a shine spark. Oh, okay, so it's the big jumpy, right? Hey, I know. Oh, it's like a little jetpack. Nice. Yeah, okay. Hey, there's my fourth energy part. Nice. That's how I'm supposed to do this one, right? Whoops, thought I had to go Whoops! I missed. Let me do that one again. How do I, wait, how do I set it off? Dang it. How do you set off the shine spark? There we go. 
So you start the jump and then you direct it once she loads into it. Got it. Maybe you can spark as ball. Come at me. A graboid looking nerd. No, wait, this is the... Right, this is the end room I just cleared out. Ah, I see. Just gotta... Nice. That jump is fall. I love how these areas get repopulated with other enemies once you've gotten rid of the, uh... Oh, what is that? Hmm. If I go from the other side... that from the other side. Oh yeah, in the first area here in ow, in Dairon there was a uh, Zoomies. Oh, and there's one. There we go. Come on, where's the secret? back here. Yeah, we'll come back. Save room. Also, there's a part earlier on here where you can be ball, which I have not touched yet, so probably do that too. Fill my juice. Grape juice. Arthas or Tauria. That's the one. Do, do I want it? I guess I want to do that. Oh, I, ah, I forgot to do the ball thing. Ah, whatever. I'll be back.
Uh, loading. Revision. What's this revision? What's this revision I'm hearing from mine work? What do you need from me? Don Tolliver. What do I gotta do on this Don Tolliver promo? What's the problem? Well, you should have told me that. Always the most frustrating thing when, um, when a client doesn't tell you how something's pronounced, just assumes you know how to say it, and then later they're just like, uh, you, that's not how to say it. It's like, bruh, unless it's something I can look up easily, which your name, your personal name is not that, unless you were a, a big time celebrity, then tell me how to say it, you fingus. messes with my brain a little bit, because you gotta, like, basically charge it and then direct it, but in the hang of it. That how I do these. Grapple beam. Oh, so I'm gonna yank those. I gotcha. All right. Hold ZR and press Y to fire. Okay. Oh, it's just an elevator. Well, sure. I saw someone responding to my link in the chat. Let me go check that out real quick.
Okay. There we go. Uh, whoops. Going in there, Samus. Whoa. Oh, that was the ball thing I was going to check out anyway, so that works out. Come on now. Excuse me. Let's take a shortcut through the Emmy Zone. Got the timing down on these guys. Whoops. Come on. Whoops. There we go. Whoops, that's why I haven't gone in here. That's why I haven't gone in here. I remember now. It's chilly. Dang it. Locked myself in. I remember there was a grapple thing I had to do, but I don't remember where. Even... I think it was in Berenia. minute. Let me 
go around to the enemy zone here so that I can unlock that. Just in case. Dude, I cannot wait for speed runs of this game. Those are gonna be ridiculous. With the kind of movement you get. Oh my god. Oh, I can't. I can't even begin to imagine how awesome the speed runs of this are gonna be. Energy tank! E tank, E tank. Now that I'm not as pressed for time. The big boy. Why must you harm him? Ah, there it is. Missile tank. Can't pass up the opportunity to save. Not in the metroid. There, okay. Hey, welcome back, Star. Should I refer to you as Mr. The Foxy? I'm just slowly making my way back to, uh, Arunia. The worst! Shoot in nine directions. Nine? I think nine. Eight directions. And like... They just... You can't just hit them with the thing. So even then you don't get the good... The, the good health drop from them for the uh, melee counter most enemies do. It's a mite frustrating. Just... Just... All right, I got the grapple beam. Needed the yellow Emmy, so I got that. Now we're heading back here to grapple our way upstairs. Ah, dang it! Knock it off! Knock it off! Oh yeah, I could probably, right? Yeah! Oh, only an energy part, eh? Bit disappointing, but okay. Oh, I gotta keep going, huh? Okay, there we go. Wait. Shortcut down there, I should probably open up. I see the the melee counter flash, right? Yeah. I see, I see it flash, but it's too high up to really melee. 
Unless, uh, Adam did say I was gonna get the space jump. That'll probably be good for it. Save here. Yes. Quick save. No, no, no. I have plenty of health. I just don't want to deal with that. Oh, so they do respawn fully. It's just you gotta wait for the door to close all the way. Okay. Yep, there it is. Oh, wait! No, I can't do it from this side. Ah, oh, dang it. Okay, so I gotta get up there? I wised up on this bit. <laughs> I feel real dumb realizing how simple it was. What is your wow for? I don't remember what I said. Was it offensive? I apologize. <laughs> or was I just being really dumb? In either case. Sorry. Oh wow, that, that sounds like how arcade games would have the kill screen. Where, um, ah, here we go. Where like, if you got to a certain level, it's just, if it wasn't designed to go that high, so it was just like, nope, mm, nope, you're not playing the game anymore. You're done. Cause like, at a certain point, they can only go, ah, dang it. Ah. did watch, um, the, the guy I raided over to yesterday was playing Dread, and he was complaining about how, like, every indie game studio for a while was making just Metroidvania after Metroidvania, and I can agree to a point. It got pretty obnoxious, because everybody was just like, you just make it big and, you know, whatever. But, like, seems a little salty. Nine and a half me oh my god. Also, it's called the Mother Metroid and not the Daughter Metroid? I, th I think Daughter makes more sense, to me at least. Right? Like child. The child of the Metroid. Whoops. Can I do it? Oh wait, free aim and that? There it is. Whoop. Ah, jumping in the water is like 
kind of nerve-wracking. Oh, come on. Well, I figured out the puzzle up to that point, at least. It seems like the most obnoxious enemies are the ones that are from uh, Metroid 2, I'm pretty sure. I don't know if that's just like a coincidence or something, but it seems like they are the most annoying in general. Nothing to do over there. map to see where the, uh, the grapple doors are. There's a grapple thing. Hmm. Some over here, maybe? Not a lot more I can do. Hmm. I'm I'm a little stumped. Uh I you know what? It's about the top of the hour. I'm gonna take a quick break. Come back to this fresh in just a minute. Go stretch your legs, drink some water, folks. Stay healthy, but I will be right back in just a minute. Don't go anywhere. Don't touch the internet dial. More Metroid Dread in just a minute.
Okay, I'm back. Ah. Let me get framed back up here. There we go. Um, I appreciate the offer of help, Star. Uh, I'm gonna look around for a minute still. I think I gotta go back to Dayron now? Or did I already do that? Man. Oh, looks like I can do that now, so I'll, I'll run up there and do that. Run away! Run away! Oops. Oh, can't go this way. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna search around a little bit more first. So far, aside from that one moment where I just could not figure out that I had to backtrack uh, to Katara or whatever, Kataria, what is it? Cataris. Um, aside from that moment, I've been able to, in a couple minutes, figure out where I was meant to go. So, hopefully I can do that again. Whoa! Watch out. Right. Uh, where was I going? Okay. This way. This is the way I want to go. Whoops. Whoa, whoa. So I'm pretty sure with the grapple beam, I can get that missile tank. Watch out now. Ah, dang it. I gotta say, the transition animation... Yeah, from, a uh, Ball and back. That's a little hokey. Like, she just starts kneeling. Ball. Starts. Ball. It's just a, a, a single frame snap to, now I'm ball. And it's like, it's not a problem or anything, it just looks really silly when you notice it. Some kind of secrets. I feel like there's some kind of secrets here. I, I think I already got whatever that was. Well, I got the missile tank, so that's why I came back here. Now I'm gonna try back to Barinia. Yeah, this is... Oh, yeah, this is the shuttle I was looking at. And I'm in Barinia. I'm heading to Dayron. Let's let's see what that's all about. Let's give it a shot. Casual run, so I'm not too worried about making, like, significant progress. I think I'll be able to beat the main story uh, by the end of the stream tomorrow, but I'm not rushing. I'm just having a good time. I'm just a couple of guy messing around. Here. 
right, I did the Emmy stuff. That looks like something. Oh. Yeah, it's just, uh, back up. Let's see, what haven't I checked? Oh, hey. I haven't looked at that area. Get that shot real quick. Uh, wasn't really much of anything. Oh well. I don't actually think I need to do that, right? I mean, it's you just gotta check all the areas. You know, this is Metroid. You go, you jumpies. Rounds. Figure it out. That's Arteria. That's an elevator. Wait a minute, that's an elevator. Right. Ah! Yep, that's it. Elevator over here. I see now. So I gotta go. Where am I? Oh no, I've lost Samus. Where am I at? <laughs> oh, all the way down here. Okay, so I need to make my way up here. Okay. Ow. Uh, well, that's just ammo, so this is right now. Wow. Come on, let me up. Let me up. Wow. Damn, got him. Got him. Whoops. Feels like I've all grown up. I can do big old wall jumps now. Granted, the wall jumps in this are a million times easier than they were in Super Metroid, but that's a that's a big part of why I'm like, this feels like what they were trying to do. It's like the wall jumps were pretty revolutionary as a concept, but now it's like we've pretty much perfected the idea. So I'm glad that Metroid's movement system has caught up with the times. You just... Ah, beautiful. Slick. And there it is. 
right. Yeah, I came over here. But I didn't have the grapple beam yet at the time. Here we go. I got it. We're going back to Artaria. No, we're going up. New region. What's this? Berenia. We're getting pretty close to the ship. Feeling pretty good, making some progress. My camera is a little high. Hold on. About there? Yeah, perfect. I could always put the camera, like, over there so that you guys see me straight on. I don't know. I, I kind of like having it to the side like this. It feels feels a little more unique, and it also means that like the way I have it set up, it looks like I'm looking at the game, which I'm looking at the game here, and then I'm also looking at the game you know, on the actual stream, and it looks pretty neat. I like it. I think it's cool. Oh, yeah. I like that it, the grapple beam, like, um, functions as, like, rope, kind of. Oops. Oh. I already told they were bad business. Oh, boy. Emmy number five? Six? Whoops. Well, that was a trap. The Chozo. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, that guy. That was a long time ago. Mm -hmm. Got hit right in the gut. Whoa! Purple Emmy. Oh. Oh! Someone's controlling them. Is that the guy? That's... no? Well... That's kind of the guy. This one sucks? Okay. Yeah, it looks pretty intimidating. They all do, though. Those Emmy are scary. I was gonna say there's voice acting, but uh, this is a, this is a uh, Con Lang, so. The fun, fun vocabulary word. Con Lang means fake languages that were created for media. Okay. Okay. That tracks. Ashkar Behek, Hasari Gale Ubana Dosh Elegar Mir Ninu Barash Nek Iliferun Dar Hadar Les Ninu Kedar Ilimathro in Mugi Tanam Dar Bi Hadar Bunta Edis Dosh Eka Iligiel Ashkar Behek Gabori Dosh Balan Ilimathro Dosh Ilitarin Nalima Hem Satar Kumbim Bi Kalki Sakra Okay. I mean, I, I guess I appreciate the story, but like, this is the most boring way. Just drop in a bird man to squawk it at me. Is that racist? I don't want to be racist to the bird man.
Les nuda cantos queren humajar corgangal turuta mazroid. Sabalba, un talaris le shaxi. So is this purple one, is this the fifth or the, the fifth or the The fifth or the sixth? Uh, Emmy. I lost count. An imposter. That's pretty sus. So they got warrior cat names? They're using the X, right? Right? That's what's happening? You guys don't need to have her idle stance. The, the, this sassy, cocked hip look. That's not necessary. Oh. Oh, that makes sense. Oh, that's what the Emmy, they, they take the DNA with their needle. Oh, it all makes sense. Metroid talking. Ata estor taboris purahama. Ana habar kisadi ilisa. Oh, hey, thanks. Okay. Yeah, I, I was wondering what's going on. Ata mata Samus. Samus. See, I say Samus as a joke, but he actually said Samus. What uh oh This is not great for me. Let's just, we're just going to leave here for now. Oh, guess not. Come on. Oh boy. This is tricky. I'm guessing there's like a melee counter I'm not seeing. Oh my god. Although, technically, because Metroid is the Chozo word for, like, Ultimate Warrior, technically, you could say Samus is a Metroid. Maybe? I don't know. Okay, well... Uh, I don't know. I have no clue how I was supposed to do, oh, do that. Good thing they let you skip the cutscenes. Okay, ow, ow, ow. Ow. Oh, there, yep. Ah, crap. Probably should have been using missiles there. Whoops. Ah. Wow, they, yeah, this one's real tricky. All right. All right. Come on now. Come on now. Ow. Ah, I forgot to use the missiles. Fine, fine. Ah. Ow. Stop. Not allowed, able to melee con counter that. Ow. Oh. 
Okay, when he does the overhand one, that's the melee counter. Got it. Okay, so I just gotta basically dodge around until he does the overhand swipe, melee counter that, and then just wreck his nonsense with some missiles. I got it, I got it. Dang it! I missed my shot. Use this more. The little balls are just obnoxious. Little pew pew. Ah, fr that was the tell. Got. I gotta figure out the tell. not get it no nope. yeah I might not get it on that one but I'm starting to understand the pattern All right ow oh he started out with one oh there we go there we go gotta get him Spread on that one. Ah, right. I saw that one coming, I just missed it. Ah! Ah, oh, criminy! Yeah, this is tough. Ah, frick. Ooh. Ah, crap. bones. Ah, dang it! I keep missing my shot to get the melee counter. I'm so gun- I'm so gun shy about the, uh, the other one. It's so brutal. Which I think is the intent. Dang it. I just timed that one wrong. Ooh, I just timed that one wrong. <laughs> yeah. This is the bet. I don't have any Metroid shirts or any, like, really horror. I got some horror shirts, I guess. I got, like, a. I got, like, a Junji Ito one that's kind of cute, but you can't even see my shirt, really. Ow. On, uh. On stream, so. Figured I'd, I'd do something spooky. Whoa. Ow. Whoa. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. 
All right. This one's really giving me a run for the money. I really am not raging with this game at all. I raged with like all of the others towards like the end. I don't know. The end could still be a while's off though. Oops. Come on now. Come on. Ow, ow, ow. Meow. Whoa, oh. Yeah. Oh, you can only really hit him like. Yep. Maybe I should bring him up there so he can't take much. Well. Nope. Come on then. Be an easier way to damage him. It feels like I'm not getting that many opportunities every time I do the melee counter. Oh, 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 ow, oh. Very cool. Ah, dang it. I'm trying to <laughs> play very close attention to, uh, Very close attention to which swipe attack you can do. I gotta get those melee counters. Oh, there's one. Man, I shouldn't waste three missiles. It looks like I can only really hit them once. Oops. Down on that a little bit. Well, hey, I appreciate you dropping in barely 10. Ah! Oh! Oh! I only really get him with the one, I guess. That's okay. Nope, nope. Ah, oh, dang it. Whoa! Ah, oh, crap, crap, crap. Ah, criminy. Yeah, thanks for dropping in, Barely10. Have a good stream yourself. If I'm still streaming when you're done, right over to me. If you know, you're still streaming when I'm done, I'll right over to you. The usual. Wow. Yeah. Okay, this pattern isn't too hard to deal with. It's just a matter of paying attention to which which blade maneuver he's gonna do. on by I'll take you out oops didn't have enough A on there come on dude do the other one do the over slash 
do the big time rush. Oh, oh, oh. I don't know, I never watched Big Time Rush. I just saw that one vine. I was like, dude, we're gonna be late for school. Calm down, I don't know why you're in such a Big Time Rush. Oh, oh, oh. Hello? Oh, dang it. Ah! Ah, dang it! Ah, dang it! Two in a row and I totally missed them. Ah. Oh, it's pretty tough. It's the main thing is I keep missing my opportunities to do the melee counter. Is there any way I can damage him? Uh, when I do it, like I can get like one missile off, but then he like he's basically just invulnerable again. Getting pretty decent at dodging his patterns, though, so that's pretty good. Oh my god, it's relentless. Ah, damn it! I got so deep into the pattern that I totally forgot what I was waiting for. Another shot, dude. Ah, 
Ah, damn it, I missed it. Ah! Holy crap! Wrong button. Fine. Come up here. Damn it! Reflexes were a little, ah, little slow on that. Well, yeah, I think my hands are kind of tired. I'm gonna give it three more shots, and if I can't get it, I'm gonna end the stream. Three more. <coughs> my reflexes are just going. It's It's been a bit, you know? Oh, that's not a great start. Oh, that's not a great start. where you just putz around. You know what I mean? Like, I'm just waiting for an opportunity to hit him. Not particularly challenging in its own right. <clears throat> if anything, your biggest enemy here is monotony. You're just like, your brain gets in such a mode that you totally miss your shot, which has happened to me quite a few times now. Yeah, I can't say I'm a fan of this particular boss. The other ones so far have been pretty good. This one... This is honestly pretty dull. Like, his stuff is not really that hard to dodge. He himself... It's just kind of annoying. It feels... It feels very Ocarina of Time, where it's just a lot of waiting for him to give you an opportunity. I'm not really a fan of that type of combat. Yeah, the monotony just causes you to, like, lose your reflexes over time. He 
gave me all these platforms, but they don't really mean anything. him into doing the one I need. Is that it? Is that the way? Dodging and zipping, dodging and zipping. Doesn't even feel like a challenge at a certain point. Once you get used to his pattern, it's it's dang dull. Like when an FPS has a circle strafing a boss. Like, I mean, technically I'm playing, but. Uh, waiting to see what he does. Dipping over and waiting for him to give me a shot. of difficulty at first, but now it's like... Ugh. Alright. Two more attempts. Then we'll call it a stream. Hold on. Actually... I'm gonna look this one up, because I feel like there has to be a better way to do this, right? Can't, this can't be it. Ferenia. Oh no, have they not actually made a walkthrough for this fight yet? Fresh. Nope. Polygon does not have walkthrough for this particular fight yet, so. Ah, two more shots. I can't. 
can't believe that this is it. Like, there has to be some kind of trick, right? It can't literally just be this. Just zipping back and forth, waiting for him to give me an opportunity to hit him. And out of, with all the other, like, awesome bosses they've had so far, this can't be... This can't be the boss. I, there has to be, like, some other way to, like, hit him. Oh! There is! You can just charge beam him. Looks like any time. Oh, god damn it. This is super easy, then. Thought you had to wait until you got the zippy zap, but it looks like you can just, you can just do this whenever. Wow, and you can't even knock your missiles out of the air. Now I'm being a little sloppier, because I realize that. I guess I was really overestimating him. He's actually super easy. Great. I was just, I, I just overestimated how much I had to do. That was actually very easy once I figured that out. Oh no, he's dead. Rest in bird, Kaka. All right. Uh, oh, well, I guess there's not really anything else in here. Okay. Well, uh, I guess that's uh, that's that. God. Do not use the free aim enough. Oops. Oh, do I have to? Yeah. Oh, okay. I had the wall jump. Yep, there it is. Oh, you son of a butt. Hmm. How am I to do this? Ice. Uh, that, like me. All right, let's get to a save point, and then I'm gonna call it Dayron. Yeah, that fight was—it's really obnoxious that it was actually not that difficult. I just assumed. I just assumed you had to uh, expose a weak point, but guess I was already good. Oh well. Sweaty. I did just moisturize before this. Alright. Ah, this this area. Let's see. Yep, we got Adam. So let's figure out what's going on and then save. I'll call it a stream. Uploading data. Our Fofa friend has explained why. We now know why the enemy are pursuing you. Samus Aaron, Raven beat your you here. He wants the Metroid DNA that exists only within you. I have yes, I am aware. That quiet I, I was there for the whole thing. All, remaining enemy. You should now be able to reach the surface on all these names, these are like warrior cat names. The root quiet rope opened is in Berenia. Return there immediately. Alright. Saving. That'll do it for today. So, 
it's it's pretty fun. That boss was pretty annoying, but uh, yeah, I, I'm still loving Dread, and I think I'll be able to finish it up on the stream tomorrow, but that'll do it for today, so thank you very much for inviting me into your home computer, tablet, laptop, gaming, console, Roku, Apple TV, however it is you watch today. I hope I brought some entertainment and levity into your life. I hope you'll check it out in the past, the uh, the future on the past broadcast tab or Iggy Kid Twitch Archive when I get that working again. It's a Twitch-wide thing. I don't know what's up. But, uh, yeah, whenever that gets set back up, you'll see see them on there. Uh, please be sure to follow there. That's linked down below on the browser version. Follow my YouTube, Iggy and the Ape. Follow me on Twitter, at IggyDKid. And follow me and subscribe here. Use your Twitch Prime sub. Connect your Amazon account to your Twitch account, and you get one free sub a week. Use it on me. I appreciate it, because I know you will. And, uh, yeah, hope you'll join me tomorrow for more Metroid Dread around noon. And... Yeah, thank you very much for watching, and if no one else has told you this, I'll tell you this. You're a good kid. Thanks for watching, everybody. All right, we're going to raid you over to uh, Box Boy, barely 10, so one sec. I'm going to switch over to here. Oops, uh, that's the one I want. There we go. All right. Slash raid. Barely. All right. Ah, oh, dang it. I auto-corrected. Just two separate words. Hold on. Alright, there's barely ten. Go let them know I sent you. Have a good time watching that. See y'all tomorrow. Alright, have a good one. Goodbye. Goodbye. A uh, Goodbye.